Play chip off promo, you all know. Draymond Green, that's good. He has an 88. Almost there. Brother downstairs. Auctions. Bro. Nikhil is selling for a lot. Nikhil has Xander Walker. Look at the tight players. 80. Look at them. They're selling for like 430,000. They're selling for a bunch. And then after that. 82 overalls are selling for 1.8 million. Come on, brother. This is my power rankings for now. My brother here. I'm about to get. Sam, get your, get your account. These every day they restart. And then, and then, and then they, um, good. They're pretty good. My Lynn is so good. Look at Lynn's. Lynn is a beast, like, actually a beast. I'm probably triple up, quadruple uploading, quintuple uploading today. It's pretty easy to upload videos for me because I don't really edit too much. Bro, I just got blocked. The slam. My man Ewing. Bro, Jeremy is too good. I put him better than Chauncey Billups. You know how bad Chauncey Billups is. He can't play no nothing. He can't play anything. So Jeremy with the awesome dunk. PJ Washington somehow starting in this season. Oh, yes, no, yes, yes, yes. Jeremy with the dunk easily. Jeremy actually missed the dunk one time. Only once, though. I was kind of mad. My brother up here. Cody missed it, of course, because he's sucky. There has been a glitch. Sometimes this Tatum gets the buzzer beater instead of the other Tatum, and he misses somehow. Okay. No, that's a make. That's a bad thing. From three, Lynn is going to make. Let's go! Jeremy Lin is a beast. Season 4 is going pretty good for now. Let me get that steel pickpocket. Let me pass it to Tatum and with a dunk, he makes it. But one time I had to win more than... I had to win by 9 because they didn't count the 7. Today and tomorrow I'm probably called Drooper Jim quadruple or quintuple uploading cuz come on season 4 is good Jokic with the dunk easily oh and he fell sucky Cody Zeller you suck okay so you see I opened an 80 overall pack and I was not happy cuz I got Rui Hachimara who is kind of not an um, update team for me. So I sold it for 250000 easily. I mean, like, 10 minutes, just like, someone bought it for $350,000 coins. And now I have 3 million coins almost. See, you should not buy anyone for now. Also, if you have ads, do not use it for stamina. Use it for the tip-off points. That will give you better stuff. They lost. I have almost. 
I just need to play one more time. Easy sauce. But this team is good. Somehow, all their players are elite. The tip-off promo, I mean, like, it's 82 overalls, which is, like, the Masters are 82, which is low for this. Last year, their first campaign had an 83 Master. And this is kind of not grindable with that Jeremy Lin making a double hand windmill. It's kind of not grindable, season this tip off from a, But at first, I thought it was like actually like not grindable. You can only do events. But then I figured out that the season gives you points every time you play. And that's really good. And showdown too. But you should play season, not showdown, because. Showdown, you can win. If you're good at showdown, do it. But if you're not good like me, like I sometimes lose, that's like a 50 stamina of waste. But in season in season mode, you can easily you can easily get like you know 250 points. Even with the boost, you get like 275. And then after that, you like get like a lot of good stuff. Does power rankings even give you Kim? It's kind of like power rankings, I think, is like legacy from last year. Legacy was like not good though. But, but it did give you points for the like some promos, legacy. And that was good, but nothing else was good. And my legacy team was pretty bad because I actually did not play season two. But I still somehow got legacy. But I played season one. But I'm like. I think I got a super rare card in season one. So I got a LeBron James Center, 85 overall. From a pro pack? Well, I don't know if that's true though. But I got a LeBron James. That's an elite. But I didn't like season one because it has like 84 overall is the like elite mark. But now they have like but now also they don't have any more update team. It's like lineups like season one, which is actually okay for me. I don't really care about update team because like you see Chauncey Billups was kind of trashy, and I had to move my man Lin in. So yeah, lineups make it much better. Because I think Lin and Chauncey are... But, but Lin and Chauncey are in the same lineup shooting. I don't think you can sell any more of your... Season 3. Because that would just make it too good. I don't think anyone has sold... Their players from the... Tip-off promo. The elites. Oh no, tip off seems okay. Because you get a 79, which is pretty good for all of you guys. Unless you're really good people already. Well, it's good for me. My man, Cool Creator, is good. He grabs with me now, Cool Creator, my man. Jeremy Lin has like. A really good variety, a very good variety of, oh, I should have done buzzer beating. Jeremy Lin has a very good variety of, yeah. Jeremy Lin has a really good variety of dunk animations. Like, some of them were new, I never know, in season three. Moon, chapter two key. For the ooh and B shards, okay. Yeah, I got chapter two. I got chapter two. Yeah, chapter two. Well, it's just the same thing. It's kind of bad. But the Bulls. Let's see everyone's lineups. The Sun, how did they make it to you? 
They do get root beer. Chill. This team's good. My Chicago Bulls. Ooh, Otto Porter. Wait, how is Otto Porter 86 and with no card? I mean, and Larry Market, but Zach Levine's only 83. Does not make sense. Does not make sense that DeAndre Hunter is 81 somehow. And yeah.